Famous person to emerge from the Auckland suburb of Mount Albert. Even more well known than AB's legend Brian Williams or current residents Sonny Bill Williams and Helen Clark. I don't know if Helen will agree with that. Uh, Lucy Lawless has featured in so many things, but now there's an exciting new entry for her wiki page as part of a Kiwi made animated movie that's set to take on the world stage. Got to ask you, Donald Trump, what did he yeah. nearly say to you? She's lit up our screens for decades now, first on adverts, then as the star of a certain fantasy blockbuster that also made her a lesbian icon. She's also been a common sight at the sharp end of a number of environmental causes. But her latest adventure isn't quite so intrepid or even visible. She's lending her voice, along with some other Kiwi stars, to the new film Mosley. Lucy Lawless, what a pleasure to have you on the couch. Welcome a along to Stephen. pleasure to be on your couch, thank you. Tell us about Mosley, a new animated feature. Yeah, and it's all made here in New Zealand. So a bunch cool. of New Zealanders upskilling to make this absolutely luscious, luminescent, really touching story about um, these kind of beasts of burden who get emancipated by all sorts of mystical, wonderful adventures. And it must be nice to turn up to work in your Ugg boots and your sweatshirt. <laughs> I do every day. It's somebody else's job to transform me from, you know, Farmer Joe to whatever I'm playing that day. But is it quite different doing in animation, doing voice work? I mean, do you have yeah. to use a different voice, for example? You, ha you have to use your voice, and um, but it's a different kind of performance, so it's about where you place it. I, I, I believe it's just like Broadway singing. How Broadway singing, because it's up here and you're, you can talk and you can do it all day long, and it doesn't hurt your throat. Mosley, come here quick, the calf is moving. Wow. He's active, isn't he? Hey, could be a she. <laughs> it could be, but I don't know. I, I've got a feeling about oh, this one. Oh, a feeling, huh? All right, but that didn't work out too well for you last time. Obviously, it's a kid's film, but yep. as adults, do you go along like the Shreks where you go, oh, this is so good, you yes. get the jokes? and Exactly. It's one of those uh, movies that the parents can go along and not find it tiresome, you know? <laughs> Lucy, you've been at the forefront of environmental issues for a long time. You were talking about climate change a long time ago. You must be happy now with how much people are talking about climate change. I'm very relieved. Um, I am very happy because I think the grown-ups, instead of saying, oh, the kids will fix it, are starting to go, oh, our kids are going to make us fix it. And I think that's just and right. Wish we had done it 20 years ago, but the second best time is now, as they say. Yeah, so you'd be a big fan then than, uh, for young Greta? Oh, I'm a huge fan. Um, she's, given, she's, she's given me strength back, you know? You kind of get compassion fatigue when you're just beating this drum and feeling um, like nobody's... Uh, getting getting down with the program. Lucy, I once heard that Donald Trump asked you out on a date. Is that true? So weird. He rang oh me up. Gosh. I was staying in his hotel. The phone rings and um, it's Donald Trump. And he asks me out and I'm like, oh, yeah, well, no, sorry. I'm, you know, oh, just got engaged. He'd seen me in the lobby. That's what it was. He That's saw me in the talk. lobby doing some press or something. And I saw him. He didn't pay any attention. He just went... <laughs> and walked off, but I got a call like, later that day. Are you sure he hadn't been looking at Xena tapes? I, I, I don't <laughs> know what that guy says. Anyway, but I was like, why am I sort of, what was wrong with this interaction? And my friend said, because he used his hotel, you know, the guest list of the hotel as his dating pool. I was like, yes, that was so, it, it crossed a line. Why do I feel really a little creeped out okay. by that. Hey, we have to ask, do people still come up and do the Xena? I had to, I had to do the Xena voice for, for Jeremy earlier. Do people Tony's still come up and do Tony's it to you? Good at it. Very good. No, people don't. I got screamed at by a meth addict last week, but oh. other than that, no, that's the closest I've come. Can you, you do it? Do it. No. Come on, go on, do the go on. on. Okay, here we go. Was that good? <sighs> It was like listening in a mirror. OMG! <laughs> thank you for making me do that. <laughs> Lucy, thank you so much for coming in. It's lovely to have you on Pleasure. 7 Sharp. Thanks. Good. Best of luck with everything. Cheers.